What's going on guys? So today we're gonna to be doing a walkthrough of my garage gym. It's one of the highly requested videos, especially from my Instagram followers because they see me working out sometimes. I post some videos on there. And so I thought I'd do a walkthrough because people like to see that. So my garage gym is uh, gear I've kind of accumulated over the years. I used to go to Globo gyms like most everybody else, but the, the problem is is that one, it took me 20 minutes there and 20 minutes back. So instead of driving, I could have done my whole workout. And then waiting on people getting in the way every uh, January until March the gym is packed and you know people in your way and can't get on equipment so I decided a few years ago just to build my own gym and that way I could work out any time of day especially with Black Scout it keeps me really busy sometimes I have to work out in the middle of the night versus you know having a normal schedule we'll kind of do a walkthrough of all my items and I'll kind of talk about that I'll talk about what I think if you're building a home gym or you're wanting to work out from home what are the essential items so, so I got an old cheap bicycle um, stationary bike I'll run this you know some days just to get some cardio in if I can't go for like a sprints or things like that I have a ball here the ball is to be used with my kettlebell weightlifting and things like that I'll kind of show some of that in a future video so some uh, Olympic style plates here bumper bumper plates I think they're called and uh, for dropping doing deadlifts and you know snatches cleans all that sort of thing I have obviously a barbell here this is my not my main one I have a, a Olympic size barbell too a friend of mine's bar down the street so but I have that one as well I don't do a lot of barbell stuff anymore versus what I used to do um, but I still I still use it for certain things and I keep my collie stuff here so I got my you know my knives and my collie oh, my collie sticks you know in case I need to do some training with that as well moving on I have a slam ball here this is a 45 pound I use this a lot I've got a assortment of kettleballs here ranging from 20 pounds up to this 75 pound I think this is 65 52 and I got actually more of these delivering today the boom bells they look like grenades are good not just because of the look of them but if you notice the shape of the handle it's really good because you can fit two hands in here doing push-ups on them versus a standard how it's <clears throat> kind of curved I got an assortment of dumbbells here I do a lot of dumbbell stuff uh, medicine ball I have other accessories like a landmine landmine attachment that's in, used in conjunction with a barbell and stuff like that and the plates which is a good thing plyo box I use I mean almost daily I think it's critical to do plyometrics and jumping getting your body very it uh, helps you with athleticism you know then my plate carrier I use this for doing weighted burpees uh, runs uh, push-ups you know pull-ups dips all those sort of things um, I got a yoga mat here in case I go do, do something else I got a, a ruck plate there throw my pack and do some you know rucking this is my, I think this is called steel, steel Body. I had this thing a few years. I actually, how, how I wound up with this one is that uh, I had ordered a, a big, bigger rack and it wouldn't, wouldn't fit in my old uh, spot where I worked out. And so I had to find the most, you know, the smallest one I could and I wound up finding this one because how slim it is. And I've been using it and I, I fell in love with it. I like it because it's really versatile. I can do dips here so I can remove these. The bench is attached. I can fold it out of the way. You know, I got my pull-ups. I do squats, bench, deadlift. I'm sorry, squat, uh, bench, pull-ups, dips, all those sort of things. I've got a TRX so I can run my TRX off of it. TRX is great too. You can work out pretty much anywhere. Back on, on this real quick, my personal trainer, a guy named JL Fitness Miami. He and I created a program called Tactical Athlete Program. You can go to my Instagram account and we have it posted on there. But anyhow, you can buy these posters from him. So he has, uh, I got dumbbell, kettlebell, and body weight. Also has a female body weight version too. And basically what you can do is pick and choose these exercises and work off of. So that's a good reference guide, especially if you're looking at like techniques or things like that or something to add to your arsenal. Over here, my good friend and business partner had just cut out for me a few years ago, uh, this Black Scout hanger here. 
but I've got a, a assortment of bands. So this is like a push up one. This is one to help with pull ups. I don't really need that, but um, somebody, if somebody works out with me, they'll use it sometimes. I have uh, various assortment bands. Bands are great. They're a great tool. I like them because you can carry them anywhere. You can do a lot of stuff with them. And then uh, I've got an agility, agility ladder. I've got some other odd things to do with like military press and stuff like that. And my uh, punching bag here that I just rig up from the ceiling over here. And a few jump ropes uh, too, because I do a lot of jump ropes. And I, I like it, I think it's uh, uh, jump ropes a good, good thing, just like the player box. So get your heart rate up and uh, good things. But like I said, bands are a good element to have. All right guys, so this is a few things I use a lot as well. Sandbags, this is, a, I got brute force here. I got two of those and I got a Titan Fitness. A lot of my gear is Titan Fitness. They're a pretty reasonable brand and the quality is actually pretty good, especially for like CrossFit-esque equipment. But yeah, I love the sandbags. I use them all the time. And this part of the tactical athlete program too, you'll see sandbags in there. Battle ropes, I use these a ton too. They're great because it's uh, upper body kind of cardio type stuff and gives you strength at the same time. I've got some plates on a weight belt there. So for doing pull-ups and dips and things like that, and I just do have an easy curl bar because you know you got to do the curls for the girls. So. so that's my home gym, guys. I hope you enjoyed that. And the the main things, I guess, the takeaway if you're if you're going to be working out from home, my recommendation is a kettlebell. Probably, I'd say 35 to 45 depends on you know how strong you are. Kettlebell two would be great, but if you on a budget, at least one. And then uh, dumbbells, I'd probably get, I'd probably say to get a 40 pound and maybe a, a 20 pound or something like that. That way you can do, uh, you know, a, little, a lot of different things. Uh, dumbbell snatches and things like that, presses, and a ball because you can use that instead of a bench, a ball is much cheaper so you can do presses on the, on the ball. And bands are huge. Um, I, I, do, I do recommend those because if you're traveling anywhere, and then a sandbag. And if you, if you get those few items, you can pretty much you know, do a phenomenal workout. And like I said, we got the Tactical Athlete Program on Instagram for free, you can go check that out. And in the future, upcoming here, we're actually gonna probably film some uh, workout videos, some quick stuff, you know, things like that. I see a lot of people wasting a lot of time in the gym. You know, my, my whole training has focus, uh, changed, my focus has changed because previously, if you've seen me years ago, I was, you know, much bigger because I was focusing solely on the strength moves, uh, bench press, deadlift, squat, and military press eating whatever just because I was trying to get you know strength whereas now I'm for, focusing more on fitness versus uh, you know strength obviously you still want strength but also the fitness aspect um, as well so anyhow guys if you enjoyed this video comment below if you have any questions and as always thanks for watching Black Scout Survival. Mm -hmm.